know you're a woman right now, but this is not gonna end well. The following video drop, shows a woman- Drop a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new. ...doing a live stream inside her house, when something extremely creepy is caught on camera. The woman in this video is known as Cello Loca, who's well known for doing tarot card readings and other fortune telling activities. Yo, any of you actually done that? Because I heard about it, but I'm not sure if it's legit or not. Activities. It isn't often the case, but occasionally, Cello would go online and do a live stream where she does tarot card readings for her viewers. But, it was just recently that Cello had done something completely different. Instead of- Oh yeah, the UG board, dang, yo, this is gonna be a massive video, I, I, I'm hyped, man. I'm reading hyped, cards man. as usual, she decides to do a seance inside her house. Little did she know that this would be a big mistake. As Cello tries to make contact with the dead, she talks to a friend on the phone who's watching the live stream. She sits in front of a mirror when all of a sudden this happens. Hey! What would happen if I didn't move? The door is opening? Oh, damn, son. Where's the door? Can you see it on camera? Open up. Hey! Open up. Door. Let it open. No ah! possible. Impossible. That's what Tano no said. Possible. Impossible. Ay, Damn. No me no que estoy Don't touch me. I'm protected. No me que Don't estoy touch protegida. me because I'm protected. No vale. ya abro la luz, tía. Okay, that's it. I'm turning on the lights. Somehow, the door opens on its own. But even stranger is that it opened when Cello asked the supposed spirit to do so. Feeling completely terrified, she takes a moment to gather herself before proceeding further with the seance. What happens next has left her beyond spooked. Watch. Okay! Can you please stand in front of the mirror? Can you please stand? Why though? Are you annoyed? Can you please stand in front of the mirror? Okay, is she reading viewers? chats seems like it or is she telling the ghost i would say she's reading the the viewers comments come on stand in front of this mirror it is at this point that cello has seen enough and decides to end the live stream given what happened viewers believe that cello might have reached out to a sinister entity yet others think that something else was contacted Although pretty spooky, it could be that this whole thing was just a setup for the sole purpose of getting views. But it seems that many viewers find this video to be genuine evidence of something paranormal. But of course, you be the judge. Ghost or not? <laughs> Feel free to let me know what you think. Uh, maybe I, there was a shivava that opened the door at the bottom. Uh, I know, I know, but I'm just trying to make sense of the situation, man. I know, I know, guys. Come on, man. I know, man. Like, damn. Now, the following Number video five? barely has any information, but it still speaks for itself. Oh, my God. Where exactly this video had come from is unknown. As I felt like the kid levitated? The original source is a total mystery. All that is known is that it was found by someone online who reposted the video. In it, a small child is seen lying at a doorway when something pretty baffling happens. Take a look. I felt like that. He cut the video and... <laughs> Oh my god! According to viewers, it seems that the child was either kicked or pushed by an unseen force. Even before it happens, they seem to be scared of something, as though they are trying to get away from whoever or whatever is inside this room. Damn! The lack of info and the unknown source of this video makes it hard to determine if it's paranormal or not. For now, it remains a mystery until more info is brought forth. Bruh! My god, just lifted like a couple of inches like that, damn. Oof. Number four. Now this next video was posted in September of this year, but for some reason was taken down a few days later. Damn. Some believe that the video was removed because the person in it is so traumatized by this incident that they don't want to be reminded of what occurred. Although it's not clear what the reason might be, the o- <laughs> You might not want to look behind you. I'm just going to say that now. Don't look behind you. Owner of the footage has reposted the video for those interested in seeing it before taking it down again. It goes without saying, but the video is pretty creepy to say the least. 
in it. A security guard is working the night shift inside a private building somewhere in Colombia when something very strange happens. The guard is on duty, patrolling the area, when out of nowhere, someone greets him. Or so it seems. Take a look. Okay, so there must be a guy behind this, or he thought, and then he goes and he greets, and maybe they're watching him live, or security is watching him live, or after the fact, just analyzing the video what uh, as to what happened. Yeah, it looks like he's, yeah, he not, looks like he completely opens the door. Nobody's here. Honey, I'm home. Is he like talking to someone? Nah, nah, he's not. He did open the door. The door is still open. The door is not closing. He's waiting for the elevator. Oh, the lights turned off. <laughs> Had to burp there. The lights turned off again. Pretty sure he's quit. At the start of the clip, we can see the guard waving at someone and looking at them. But, as the video continues, no one appears. He seems to be having a conversation with someone who doesn't appear to be there. Damn! Damn! Yeah, the lights turned off. I was like, okay, man, hey, hey, I gotta pull up, you know? I got scared, bruh. The lights are flickering too. So this is the follow-up. Oh, this is the follow-up. Oh, snap. Although pretty strange, it's the following piece of information that makes this video a whole lot creepy. As it turns out, the security guard in this footage says that he was talking to someone who was in need of assistance. That someone was an old lady who was asking for directions to a place in the building. But as we can see in the footage, she doesn't appear to be there. A few minutes pass, and the guard is still chatting with whoever it might be that we can't see on camera. But then, after conversation- Yeah, bro, this is why I was saying I, I was not uh, telling and uh, not saying everything that I wanted. But in my mind, you know, when he walks or when he walk, when he opened the door and he was walking closer to the elevator, he was like somewhere here and his head was kind of turning and he his hand gesture and his movement was in a way where it felt like that he was walking with someone. But I was like watching that. I was like, is he thinking there is someone is, uh, there that he uh, and is he thinking he's talking to someone and walking with someone there? But surely we couldn't see and we cannot see. And now he's making that point as well. Dang waiting for a while he is radioed by his co-worker who tells him something that suddenly makes his blood run cold oh my Walk. yeah probably would have tell him like who you're talking to we cannot see like what's up and he's probably gonna be like hey i'm talking to this lady but they will reply we do not see any lady Lunch. he's getting that Turns around. Guard is told he's the only person on the floor. He's the only one there. Hey! <laughs> Run! Run! Oh my boy! Bro, that's messed up, man. Right away, the guard hits the button to the elevator, thinking it would open immediately, but then quickly realizes that the stairs would be a better escape. In a panic frenzy, he runs away and leaves the building without ever looking back. Oh my it isn't God. clear where exactly the guard had went, but given his response, it seems likely that it was far away from this building. Was he, was he the same person? Because it felt like he changed the shirt. It's not the same shirt. Or is it all black and all, white? So his coworkers have no doubt in their minds that this whole encounter was paranormal in nature. But, unfortunately, this whole video is a mystery. Without sufficient info, the question remains, who, or what exactly, had the security guard- Any of you scientists, if any scientists are around, I want to know your explanation. ...had been talking to. Yeah, number three, boys. There's a photo online that's been circulating through various groups on Facebook. The image was initially posted somewhere in September of this year, but ever since then, People have been getting creeped out by this photo. 
Now the photo itself comes from a family who took the image during- Okay, let's try to find it before he tells us, is this the picture? Because that feels like a hair. Feels like two faces, right? One with mask on and one, one face that I'm making it out, okay? I don't wanna... It's like looking like that. You know, with like hair and stuff. Damn, that's creepy. Bruh. Baby shower that occurred somewhere in Mexico. Lots of photos were taken at this party, but one in particular has left the family disturbed. It was only after the party was over that they looked at the photos and saw the chilling photograph that they can't seem to explain. I'm about to bust, bruh. It's nighttime, and the party seems to be going well when someone takes out their phone and begins to take various photos. They see a group of people in the corner and decide to take their picture. Little did they know that they would capture this. Hey! Uh, oh my god, there it is. Bam. Damn. Damn. The family was left shaken up after seeing this. According to them, nobody was next to this woman when they took the pic. They further mention that its facial appearance Do not look to the right. Don't look to the right. Is unlike anything they've ever seen. Although some people think that this might have been a case of pareidolia, as the rocks in the background could have been mistaken for a face, the family is certain that this wasn't a rock or something. Yeah, it doesn't, I know what you're saying, but it doesn't look like a rock, man. You got the hairline perfectly, you got eyes, you got eyes here, nose here. Okay, these two dimples, that's mouth, but what's that, right? Like, I mean... Something pareidolic. It got the whole in human-like shape, like, too. They've taken photos of the same area where the pic was taken, and none of them show the figure that was captured. So then, if this wasn't pareidolia, or someone they know, who, or what, was this? Damn, damn. Number two, boys. Number two, this number next two. video comes from a man named Chris Hill who you might recall from a previous video from exploring a band Bro, you saw those guns, bro. You saw those guns. That's the definition of Chad. And in places to seeing things that he can't explain. Chris has had his fair share of creepy occurrences, but his most recent exploration may just be the creepiest. Chris visits an abandoned warehouse at an undisclosed location. Inside, he finds a lot of empty crates and mountains of debris. Spiders? Although mostly empty, he can't help but feel a certain presence inside this building. Small critters might have made this place their home, but to Chris, it seems that something else is living here. Feeling a little terrified, he searches all around and finds nothing. Damn. But here's where things start to get really creepy. As Chris continues to explore the place, he finds a small staircase that leads him to the floor below. Don't. He takes it and finds a room with many doorways. One of them, however, leads to a narrow passage that seemingly has no end. If you see this and you're alone and the, the vibe is just mysterious, it's creepy, would you go? Chris enters the passage and immediately notices something strange. Oh my god. You're really gonna left us on a cliffhanger like that? Uh, and don't tell us what's gonna happen? Is it gonna be terrifying? Is Whoa. it gonna be chilling? Or yeah? It's noticeably colder in here. Uh-oh. Hey, hey. If you stand right here, it's kind of warm. Like normal temperature. Yeah. Oh. But as soon as you go in here, it gets cold. Oh my god. That is creepy as hell. Whoa, uh, uh. that is weird. Hey. That is weird. Like, I'm not joking. Hey. Hey. Oh, hey. It's noticeably colder. Yo, here. this, yo, this is bad. This is freaking me out, man. This is bad. I know exaggerate, wow. but, but this time it's, I exaggerate on purpose for YouTube because it makes it more entertaining. But this is like bad. Chris has no idea as to why there's a sudden change in temperature when entering inside. But confused and scared, he walks further into the passage, not sure where it would take him. He eventually arrives at an area that is more spacious and emptier. However, it is at this point when things take a dark turn. Oh snap. He goes oh. in and sets up a few cameras before exploring the whole space. One camera in particular is an infrared camera that records in real time. 
When he's done setting up all cameras, he continues to explore the site. But unbeknownst to him, this is captured. Unbeknownst to him, this is what captured? Okay, so he's not gonna see it, but we're gonna. So where should I look? Infrared? Still gotta go down there too. Oh my god, that area bad. Hey! Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, bro, I heard that, man. That was loud. Bro, don't be turning like that. I gotta itch my nose hole. I gotta itch my nose hole. I'm not looking at the infrared. I think now in the infrared. Oh snap, he gonna give us that replay, son. Yeah, someone will be behind him, I'm assuming. Like a shadow figure. As expected, but I don't see no shadow figure. Oh, now I do. Damn. And yeah, he fell that. He fell that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now on the other side. Bang. Oh my god, you see the eyes? You see the peeking? Damn. And it was there for a while, too. Had it not been for the second camera, this would have been missed. A mist like figure can be seen approaching Chris from a distance before reaching him. Eerily enough, Chris turns around as soon as the figure gets to him. And, as if that wasn't creepy enough, a strange like figure in the corner can be seen peeking at the camera. Yeah, and it's not because normally when you see videos like that, you see like a face just like looking at you for a second and just moves away, right? This was there for a couple of seconds, like solid couple of seconds. Chris has no clue as to what this could have been, but viewers can't help but think that this might have been some supernatural creature that was spying on Chris. Whatever it might have been, he is certain that he won't be coming back to this place as he's definitely spooked. No one would, bro. No one would. But as always, what are your thoughts on this? Paranormal or not? Definitely paranormal, If you caught man. something creepy on camera, over. Let's get back to the video. Number one. This last video shows a woman who appears to be very sick. The person recording claims that she might be on her deathbed. If that's so, then this video just got a whole lot interesting. Damn. A friend or relative is watching the woman on the monitor when they notice something odd about the footage. Upon looking closely, they see the following. Man, rest in peace, man. What the f is that? Hand? Is that the hand that is talking about? Is that hand? It's like something touching her. Yeah, and it's wide, completely, like a bright light. What? And this? Eh, eh, eh. No, that might be just like a small ass tree, you know, like there's a, there's like a toy like thing. What looks to be an arm reaching out to the woman on her supposed deathbed can be seen on camera. It reaches out as though whatever this is, is trying to comfort the sick woman. Some viewers have theorized that this might be the ghost of a loved one who is still oh. looking after their partner from beyond the grave. Oh man, I shouldn't have fired, man. I shouldn't have fired those bullets, man. Now I feel bad. Although pretty wholesome, it is solely a belief. Yet most viewers can't help but think this. But of course, what do you think? Had the ghost of a loved one paid a visit to this woman? Or is there a possible explanation for the ghostly arm? Feel free to let me know what you think down below. 
Man, I also made a terrible mistake of firing a lot of bullets in this video as well. Click on this video, subscribe, and I will see you right there.